8, 2009, best of the best. You know, when I think of best of the best, I think of that one time, the hottest feud in Texas All-Star Wrestling history. Zin Zin, body too bad. We whooped each other's asses all over the state. Cage matches, dog collar matches, Texas death matches. Buddy, you have cemented yourself in Texas All-Star Wrestling history. T-A-S-W legend, Bobby Too Bad. Bobby, I love you to death. Respect you. Thank the world of you. August 8th, 2009, best of the best. It's Zen Zen's turn to submit his legacy in Texas All-Star Wrestling history. That's right. August 8th, 2009, I'm going to make myself a TASW legend. Bobby, I love you. It's on. On August 8th, at the best of the best of the best of the best show at Texas All-Star Wrestling right here in Humble, Texas. Yeah, that's right. Zin Zin, the loose cannon. Yeah, I got you, and I'm going to tear you a new... Mm -hmm. That's right. It's not going to be hardcore. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to beat you the old school way. You hear me? That's right. I'm going to get this and put it on the shelf that night and then I'm going to come for you and I'm going to beat you all over Texas All-Star Arena, you hear me? And I want everybody to come out and see this. I'm not going to stop and until I get that heavyweight belt. And Zen Zen, I'm going to start by beating your ass. this very special TASW edition of the Lucha Lounge. That's right, I get contracted to do the Lucha Lounge everywhere I go. See the shirt? To mark out new color, red and black. There's no show without this guy. But seriously, August 8th, you've got a great heavyweight title match. You've got Davidson, the TASW heavyweight champ. Kudos to him. I went too many too many big top rope maneuvers and, and uh, you know, he took advantage. Going against Davey Richards, FIP World Heavyweight Champion. Well guys, when the dust is settled, you're looking at still the number one contender because, see I never put the number one contendership on the line. But speaking of which, on August 8th, best of the best, you're going to see Steve DeMarco. Yes, your reason to DeMarc out facing Gustavo Mendoza. Now, I don't have anything but the utmost respect for Gustavo Mendoza. Let's face it, the guy has won everywhere he's gone. For a guy so young in the business, the guy has a mount of knowledge you can't teach him. Been taught by some of the most well-respected wrestling royalty there is. But here, this is kind of my place, and I owe it to the fans to give them one more reason to demarc out. And to prove that what it says on the back is definitely the truth. There's no show without Steve DeMarco. I'll see you on August 8th. Later.